Hello everybody, this is AKC FPV from Thrust. Today we are going to do the part two of the series of the Omnibus build and review. Um, there is a reason why I did not complete this build and do all of this Omnibus review at one time. It is part of a series and the unveiling of a of a brand new piece. Okay. I'm so excited to show you guys this. This, this, this is awesome. Ladies and gentlemen, I would like to introduce to you the all-new Multi-RC Stretch X 6-inch. Full 4mm bottom plate, full carbon, 3D. Beautiful Clintstone mod top. There is the Omnibus. At this time, I'd also like to point something out. I have done a modification to this that, however, the, the, the Stretch X does not come to you this way. If you look over here, underneath my motor mount, I have dipped these in rubber to give my motors a soft mount and to give another layer of, of protection between my ESC and the carbon. I would just like to top, you know, point that out so that you guys, you know, if you don't like it, you know, it's, don't worry about it. it. It's full carbon fiber like everything else. This is just, this is me. I did texture the rubber and everything, you know. But um, there's also something else very unique here that I would like to point out to everybody. Say hello to the ZMX Fusion V3 motors. This is the 2205, 2550. I'm going to use this in, in 6 inch as well. These, these motors definitely, definitely have enough punch and, and enough to run a 6 inch without a problem. I'm even having to upgrade to a 2206. I like them. They're awesome. Another really interesting about the Fusion motors is on the bottom of them, I don't know if you can see, you've got an Allen head screw in there. Okay, that Allen head screw is where the bearing is. You can adjust these bearings and tighten a bearing as the bearings get old. Okay, if you're fortunate enough to where you don't crash, wreck, or destroy the motor, we now have a really good quality high power high performance motor and it is right here sold at multi rc and it is the only place in the u.s that is exclusive for selling these motors i'm going to go over a little bit about these motors and i'm going to show you the web page and how to order them to give you some more specs and details on these motors on the rc multi rc website Um, yes everybody look at the stretch here very beautiful stretch very beautiful stretch another thing that you're gonna go ahead and notice here my ESC's are completely black what this is is I have sprayed them because it's gonna be spring and it's gonna be wet there's gonna be moisture we're gonna be in the mud and we're gonna be in conductive surfaces and everything for the spring I've went ahead and I've covered these with electrical spray on tape covering. Um, I've had great, great luck with them in the past. Um, it's yet again another barrier that we can do that doesn't include too much more weight. And still, you know, we're trying to protect our equipment for the unexpected. Now let's go ahead and finish why we're here. Ladies and gentlemen, part two of the review and installation and setup of the F3 Omnibus. To Betaflight. I'm going to go into the Motors tab and the first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to run these and I'm going to make sure that my motor directions are the ones that I want before I go to BL Hilly. 
doing a simple little sink first, making sure that they'll arm. And there we go. I have to reset and come back in. Now I'm just going to give a little bit of power on the motor, final directions, and we're good to go. Now off the deal, Hilly. Well, before I go, I want to make my motor number one, two, three, four, so that I remember when I go to the O'Hilly. With your battery not plugged in, you want to connect the B.O. Hilly. Once you're inside B.O. Hilly, you will go ahead and connect your battery up. Oop, had to do it again. Connect your battery and then read setup. The only thing I like here, I love the way the motor sounded when I started, so all I'm going to do is reverse motor number one and motor number three. And then I'm going to write the setup.